Hello guys, in today's video we're gonna talk about Shopify, how to create and customize a store on Shopify for uh, stock photos and image business easy and quick. So first type Shopify on this on the search. So as we know Shopify is a tool for making online stores. Uh, it helps people sell things on the internet by creating a website where they can display and sell their products. So first of all, enter here your email address and search free trial. Now you can just uh, skip this if you want. So I'm gonna just skip all this. You can continue. Let's continue. So after you choose an account, now you're gonna wait a few seconds to build in the store and create in your account. So the first thing you have to do, you go to the online store and go to the themes. So the themes, you can change them and customize them if you want. I'm gonna just keep this the, this theme, the down theme. If you wanna select any theme, just click add and wait to install the theme. After this, you can publish it. For example, the down theme and after this, you can customize it and uh, click customize and it will take you to your homepage store. So first of all here, this is this, uh, the size you can change the style, you can make it like a mobile style or like a full screen style or like a desktop style I'm gonna just keep it like this uh, this is the settings where you can design your site your home page store so first here we have the header we have the announcement bar you can change the color scheme uh, you can show separate online you can show icons on desktop also you can uh, auto change announcements you can enable country and, country and region selector also you can enable language selector so that's it now let's move on to the announcements here you can change the text you can pass the link or search for something for example collections i'm going to select all collections now let's move on to the header so here you can change the desktop logo position you can change the main menu uh, you can change the desktop menu type you can change the sticky header also you can show separate line uh, here you can it is the mobile logo position uh, you can edit the spacing and the section pattern, the top and the bottom. So, for example, if you want to edit the same settings, so here you can edit the same settings. You can enable search suggestions. Uh, you can edit the card type. If you want to put your social media links here can add your Twitter link or Facebook or Pinterest or Instagram or whatever you want to add here so now let's move on to the logo so here you can you have to select your logo from your library just for example let's search on it on the browser just for example let's search on some logos on the browser stock uh, photos and image so for example I'm gonna choose this just for example of course you have to upload this from your library so for example this is your logo right now you can change it at any time you want you can edit it at any time here you can edit the vertical offset you can edit the desktop logo width so that's it now let's move on to the next section the image banner so here you can uh, you have two images you can add the first image from the browser and the second image you can upload it from your library or from free uh, free image So for example, choose whatever you want from here. So for example this. So the second image you can explore a uh, free image from from the, the free image library here you can edit the, the overlay opacity so this is the image here you can change the desktop content position you can show container on desktop you can change the, con the desktop content alignment uh, here you can edit the mobile content alignment also you can turn this on stack image on mobile and also you can show container on mobile so that's it 
now let's move on to the heading of the, the image banner so here you can generate the text just describe what this text is about uh, stock photos and image of course you can describe more this is just for example you can sh describe you can describe whatever you want so here you, you can select one of these suggestions here here you can edit the, the hidden size so that that's now let's move over to the buttons so here you can change the first button label you can change the first button link also you can use outline button style you can uh, if you already add the second image you can add the second button label and you can add the second button link here you can use outline button style so that's it let's move on to the next section feature collection so here you can generate the text describe what this text is about uh, stock image and photos Here you can change the heading size. Uh, just the description. You can just describe what this text is about, and you can edit the form of the text. Here you can show collection description from the admin. You can change the description style. Also, you can change the collection. Uh, here you can make product full width. You can enable view all if collection has more product than shown. Uh, you can enable carousel on desktop. Here, if you wanna edit the product card, you can edit the image ratio and the image shape. You can image second image show second image on hover. You can show window. You can show product region. If you wanna enable quick add button, and also you can enable swipe on mobile. So that's it. If you wanna add something new on your homepage, click here and select what kind of section you want to add on your homepage here. So that's it. Now let's move to the future section. The last section of the website. You can change here the the color scheme. Also you can show image sign up. You can change the heading. Uh, the heading here. You can enable follow on shop also you can show social media icons so that's it now after you're done from designing website save this and now you can go to the dashboard to the home page for example you can name your store now after you add your first product and customize your online store the next step for example you can name your store and set a payment provider so type any name you want here you can add your store phone you can change your store email uh, here you can set up a uh, payment provider you can set your shipping rates so that's it the next step now is uh, launch your online store and publish it so you can pick a plan click here and you can pick a plan or whatever, whatever you want to add pick so that's it for today that's how to customize uh, store on shopify for stock image and photos business easy and quick so that's it for today if you like this video don't forget to like and don't forget to subscribe i hope this video is helpful for you thanks for watching till the end and see you in the next video